Meanwhile, Owens Pleasure is chugging home fast on the outside. Star of the North puts five on Hell of the North, and Star of the North is a star on the rise at Canterbury Park. Star of the North, the Francis Genter Champion. But now the Alligator Hunter has taken the lead despite drifting out on the muddy track. But the Alligator Hunter is super talented. And he can just make a right turn right now into the winner circle. The Alligator Hunter is the Victor S. Myers champion. The sounds echo through the Saratoga race course, telling the stories of the destination for summer horse racing for nearly 150 years. And Echo Zulo now rolls up on the outside to take the lead from Lady Scarlet. It is Echo Zulu in front and drawing away here in the stretch. Echo Zulu putting in an impressive performance here. She won by almost five lengths. Lady Scarlet held second. It is Golden Pal in front after a half in 44 and four. And now Golden Pal is pouring it on here in the stretch. Golden Pal was impressive here at Saratoga last year, and he's very impressive again today. Is a joint third on the outside of Larger Than Life. Both of them are closing in. Larger Than Life had to slam on the brakes as Lumino surges to victory. Followed by Therapist and Corelli. The field is at the top of the stretch, and it is Rinaldi holding the lead here over Value Proposition. It's Rinaldi by a length and a half. Value Proposition is all out in second. Delaware's on the outside in third with Sacred Life down at the rail in fourth. It is Rinaldi looking for a front-running score in the Forbidden Apple, and he's got it. Ty ran a homer on the outside, gets the lead. Four lengths back, Bluegrass Cat Smile, Wendigo on the outside, 16th pole. Ty ran a homer, opens up. Giodoro has pulled up. It's Ty ran a homer, another for Isaac Castillo. Into the far turn they go and quiet secretary by a length. Going to Vegas though, cruising up now though, and going to Vegas. And quiet secretary is game, she's battling back. A close up third comes catch the eye. Dipper Acton Crystal trying to get involved late. They come for home, quiet secretary is very going to Vegas now, takes the advantage. And it's going to Vegas now, drawing clear with a furlong left to run. And going to Vegas just plain too good. Going to Vegas wins it easy. Very game, quiet secretary holds second. Avenue de France came running on strongly. For That's my horse. Oh, yeah. That's my horse. I own that horse.
free to fly, just cruising though, and it's free to fly another for Paco Lopez. They come for home now, and it is still Commander Kai, but little Juanito's flying now. Little Juanito coming powerfully down the center, and little Juanito and Ricardo Gonzalez win impressively. Little Juanito looking. Back to Takafumi in third, and then assiduously Quiberon Bay takes over late, and it will be Quiberon Bay under Paco Lopez. They're at the top of the stretch, and the critical way is let loose now, taking command inside the furlong pole and opening up. The connector is very tough, trying to fight back along the inside. Four more to Cajun Casanova. The critical way wins the Wolf Hill Stakes by about a length. Then Repo Rocks, Trash Talker, and the great Dansky. It is Baby Yoda with a two length lead. Jake Rocks giving chase, but it will be Baby Yoda and Jose Ortiz. They won by a length and a half. The field turns for home, a wide sweeping move from Bankett, and here comes Dr. Post on the outside with a furlong left to go. Bankett and Dr. Post are head and head coming to the 16th pole, and the doctor takes command. Dr. Post wins the Monmouth Cup by two. So it's three of them across as they pass the eighth pole. And it's between Chatelot and Carpe all day now. Chatelot, Carpe all day. Chatelot with a narrow lead. Carpe all day continues the battle on, but Chatelot wins it. First time out. Here is Portfolio Company now to take over the lead. James Aloysius is moving into second, then Boston Flagship, and never say no. Portfolio Company looking to hold off James Aloysius in the final 100 yards. Portfolio Company does it. First time out. Marklow is far, far back. In front of him are both Fantasioso and Glynn County. They're at the top of the stretch. Tribubon still with a two and a half length lead. A host of pursuers. Epic Bromance running a good race. Serve the King looking for room. Imperador is in second and he's coming after Tribubon. But Tribubon is going to take them all the way under Flavian Pratt to win the United Nations. It is trust our journey, but here is Wit now on the outside, and Wit has taken over the lead here, and Wit is pouring it on here in the stretch. Wit has opened up on headline report. It is Wit the leader, headline report in second, and it will be Wit to win the 106th running of the Sanford Stakes.
very, very impressive win by Watt in Blazers. Mike Smith just had to point him in the right direction. Strides home very impressively. Big Pelican Way on the outside, twirling derby between them, Gates of Evan at the rail, heads apart, three of them past the eighth pole together, Pelican Way a slight advantage, Pelican Way twirling derby, Gates of Heaven battling back on the inside, Pelican Way inching clear, Pelican Way to win it, Pelican Way won it, twirling derby. Express train running a big one. Tripoli running a huge one on the outside. Any one of the three. Tripoli on the outside. Express train and Royal Ship. Express train. The more they asked, the more he gave. Inappropriate with a clear sailing move into second, followed by Exalted Charm third. Paco Lopez takes care of business on Mose as the perfect passenger. They win by about 10 lengths. It's a length on Hey, Hey, Haley. It's a block to the rest, headed by Awesome yet again. Realtor Danny D wins it by three. Miss Allegria strikes the front and goes for home. Cowboy's daughter comes to chase Illipordi on the outside, but it's a two-horse race through the lane. Miss Allegria digs deep, finds more. Cowboy's daughter chasing her every yard of the way, but an impressive win today by Miss Allegria. Miss Allegria just over length. Cowboy's Count of Amazonia late and tis plus, they're all chasing. They chasing Neptune Storm, who's got no intention of slowing down. Neptune Storm in a powerful performance in the wicker. Neptune Storm and Flavian Pratt, very impressive. is a magician cupid's claws all heart these two nose and nose neither one of them will give an inch an eighth of a mile to go tis a magician starts to inch away cupid's claws all heart but tis a magician pulling clear late and his class came through in the end tis a magician and flavian pratt take it by about three in the end Cup